Okay, let's talk real quick about the different live streams and all that and the fallout of everything that happened leading up to all this. Um, Archie's numbers with the new crew, um, quote unquote, is hovering around the threes as it was before, the twos, the threes. It's amazing how, depending on the topic, how, the, how it fluctuates. If it's some sort of... Um, um, controversial thing or so some sort of infighting that kind of goes up but if there's like straight watch talk it might it might flatline a little bit um and you got tim you got marco um you got tpg you got the wolves of watch watch street real quick i think the two that i enjoyed the most this week was i say three i'll throw marco in there with tpg in the um in the in the interview that that was the, the, the surprise interview of of um of TPG that I thought that was decent it was good marketing on his part he's good at that I give him credit he's good at that he's good at bringing people together he's very bold you know when you watch those live streams of him walking through the streets of New York City like I'm not from New York but I've been to New York a lot when I was growing up from Ohio from I'm from Ohio, Northeast Ohio. And we used to go to New York a lot in the 80s. And <laughs> it was, I, I seen some stuff, just some visits we used to go to. Cause my my, my uh, mom is from the East Coast. Man, you see all kinds of stuff back then, you know. But now I, I'm like, like, I'm worried for him when he's walking up and down the street. He's showing his role. He's talking to these strangers. He's in these bars. He's drunk. It's late. I'm worried for you, bro. <laughs> I'm worried for you, bro. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, I don't want to say nothing like negative and put some bad energy out. But I'm like, bro, go home or get you a get you a bodyguard or something. I don't know, man. But but that that live stream and him him out and about shows his his his, his fearlessness of talking to people, strangers and whatnot. You know what I'm saying? But um. So that was a good one. Wolves of Watch Street. I think I enjoy their live stream probably the most. It's 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 a little flash. It's, a, it's information. It's um it's some office stuff. So it's pretty it's pretty cool. You know they get around a bit too. They so they got all these different people that kind of drift in and out. Uh, so I, I find them I find their stuff interesting. Um, I still think TPG. No matter what you want to say about the man, his live streams are pretty dope. You know what I'm saying? It, 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 and that whole conversation about buying them watches back and forth, that was kind of interesting. You know what I'm saying? Like, that opened my eyes up to to something that that I really never considered. Like, these dudes are probably trading around the same watches. Then they could find somebody, to, the end user, the end buyer, the person um, who's going to keep the watch. That's that's when you got a win on your hands. You know, you're trading it back and forth between your colleagues and whatnot, or people who like to who like to who like to watch trade buy sell. Then eventually, once that thing pops up, you done you done made three here, six here, five here. Then the last person you sell it to, that dude's gonna keep the damn watch. That's a win. You know what I'm saying? Especially if the shit goes back down. All right. So I thought that was interesting. Um Archie show is interesting. I mean, Archie show is cool. You know, it's some new allegations, revelations. I saw that whole thing with with um with Marco and Reddit. I couldn't find the actual Reddit post, so I'm not even sure if he put that up himself or somebody posing as him put that up. So, and getting back to Marco, Reddit, Tim, and all that kind of stuff, I kind of changed my opinion on how I feel. Who got the most out of that? I think that Tim and Marco. Um, got the most out of that relationship with Archie. He actually helped um, springboard their careers and make them money. He said that he suspects or he knows or he he has information that that they were able to make fifty thousand dollars in nine months or something like that. I mean that's, that's fucking great. You know what I'm saying? It, like I say, it, it's 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 easier ways out here to make money than just going to work and crunching numbers or doing whatever it is you do all day. You know, if you can, you know, you know what I'm saying? And, and they're living proof of that. All right. So my hand, my arm is getting tired. So 
I think that's about all I got. I thought, I, you know, I'm going to I'm gonna start trying to update these a little bit more. Um, um, it's a lot of live streams, and it's hard to keep up with them all. I'm not going to just start watching every watch live stream just because all these people are popping out of nowhere. I'm going to stick to the ones I like. Like I say, I like Roman. I like TPG. I like... Uh, I like uh, Wolves of Watch Street right now. They're they're my favorite. Um, I like uh, Archie, of course. I like the Watch Talk with Archie. His new crew, they're kind of they're kind of iffy. That this dude is kind of he's a tripped out dude, man. And Archie be giving him the business and all that. Um, so tell me what you guys think about the different live streams, the information coming out of them. But you know the one thing that that I feel that. Archie's live stream lacks. It doesn't have concrete topics that he sticks to. Not just like, well, if you're going to buy one Rolex or what's your favorite three piece collection or what's this? You know, he needs to brush up on his topics, you know, nail down into something each night. Like how to, how to get your hands on a Rolex. If you're married and you make this amount of money and, 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 this you got three kids you know that's the kind of stuff people are wanting to hear you know or how to uh you know how to um i don't know what should your fourth like something like what should your fourth wife be after you buy this many rolexes and all this should you sell this one and all that but i think a lot of it has to do with i'm, I'm curious to know how all these people are buying all these goddamn watches all the damn time because it appears to me and none of them really working Maybe that's a me problem then. Maybe it's my financial situation. All right. But that's all I got. All right. I'm going to I'm gonna start updating more. Uh, ooh, yeah. I'm going to start updating more. Do you like this background? I might even do some giveaways pretty soon. But yeah. All right. Cool. Out.